had logged 12 hours and 48 minutes of total time. There have been 244 spacewalks by U.S. astronauts performed. Today's spacewalk was the 127th station-based spacewalk for assembly and maintenance. A total of 155 spacewalks for station assembly and maintenance with a total amount of spacewalk time of 973 hours and 53 minutes, which is equal to about 40 days. Again, a quick rundown of some of the tasks that were perform performed, all of which were completed during this spacewalk. Begin with the venting of some residual ammonia that was in the failed pump module, which is now ready to be returned to Earth on a future mission for analysis. Also, the crew had retrieved a lightweight adapter plate assembly that was used to attach experiments to the outside of the Columbus module. There was installation of a camera light pan and tilt assembly on the Dexter robot, and also insulation was removed from Dexter. Dexter is now in its final configuration. There was a lens cover on the station robotic arm's elbow, elbow joint camera to protect the lens from visiting spacecraft thrusters. More insula insulation removal from the avionics assembly on the Express Logistics Carrier 4. This is was brought up by Discovery on this mission and installed on its first day. Also, there was some stowage bag gathering from the crew equipment translation aid cart and a light was installed on it and a fixed insulation to a valve module fluid line on the left hand truss segment radiator beam. Shown here is a live view outside of the space station. They are now in the night pass just across the South Atlantic Ocean, flying at about an altitude of about 227 statute miles. Both crews on board the space station have entered their crew sleep time and are not scheduled to wake up for another just under five and a half hours. This is Mission Control Houston.